Hello everybody, welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 3. I'm trying again. Excuse me. Don't. I don't want that. <gasps> My arsenal! No! No! Why is there no vehicles around ever when I need them? This is try number three. Try number three. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I don't have my arsenal! What am I doing? Ooh-wee! This little poopy pants is hungry! Let's see what happens. Get out of the way. Okay, he's on fire. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Why? Why? Why do you do that? Why do you have to just die? Why must you make death? Where's the other one? Yeah, just hurt yourself more. Fuck this, fuck this, fuck this, fuck this! Get in the court! Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Eee! Yes! Yes! Okay. Okay! Okay! Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me, you piece of shit? Third time's the charm is bullshit. That slogan is bullshit. Try number four. Okay, now where's the other one? Where's the brother? Up. <laughs> oh God. Oh yeah, there's a one token up here. What was I talking about earlier? I said that in a previous episode. Oh my God. Okay, I'm done. Don't mind me, I'm done. Alright. Now, unlike the first attempt, hopefully I don't mess this up by flipping the car and actually fully take it to the crusher like I'm intended to do. Is it that complicated? Uh, uh, no. Am I that dumb? Yes. Beep.
Hey, hey, hey. Enough of that turbulence, mister. It's taking me way too long to get to this spot. God damn it. Fare thee well, Ferelli brother. Because none of you are actually individually named. And as far as I know, there's only three. such an amazing reference. For those who don't know, that was a reference from some many films created by a man named Steve Odekirk. And he is a film director and actor. And I believe he does some writing, but, you know, that's whatever. But, uh... He is actually the man who do, uh, he made, I, uh, yeah, he directed the Eddie Murphy Nutty Professor, the first one. I don't know if he did the second one, but I know he did the first one. And he did do, not the first one, but the second one, Ace Ventura, uh, When Nature Calls. And he's also the man who did Kung Pao Enter the Fist. Oh, are you serious? All right, all right. I'm getting so inconvenienced in this episode and so chopped. All right, I'm just gonna... Uh, I'll be right back with that story. I'm gonna speed up time so I can continue with the missions, get at least one more mission done so I can finish this episode. So I'll continue this story after this break. Okay, so I'm gonna make my way back to Joey's now that we are back from the break. To continue the story, Steve Odekirk, uh, he directed the second Ace Ventura When Nature Calls and Kung Pao Enter the Fist, which he also starred in, the, the, the white actor who was replaced into the original footage that they used for Kung Pao, the main character, the chosen one, that's actually Steve Odekirk. But he, uh, he also created Jimmy Neutron, by the way. He also made these mini short film parodies of famous movies like Star Wars, Titanic, Frankenstein, and stuff like that. Um, and he did them all with thumbs. And there was this one character that had one eye, and that's all his cameo was, which is, yahoo! What a rise she's going to be, huh? Kind of looks like Listen, my face on that. Get some wheels to the safe house in St. Mark's and pick up a few friends of mine. They're hitting the bank and they need a driver. <gasps> I have the wrong vehicle! Yeah, Son of a bitch! Up. Get him to the bank before 5 o'clock. Not a minute after. Mmm, shit. Shit, shit, shitty shit. Shitterton. Shit, shitterton. I need, I need a different vehicle. And that sucks. Alright, well at least I can get to one path. I'm getting that money. Holy crap. Number one, because holy crap. And number two, um, we're gonna have a replay of that right now because I cannot wait to edit and see what that looked like and see exactly that in slow motion because I bet that was one of the coolest fucking things ever. Now we're gonna pick him up in the Borg 9 taxi. Beep, beep, beep. Bank on the main drag. So, I, if I remember right, this is the mission that we first can get three stars automatic. Luckily enough, I got two at my hideout. 
Scream, scream, scream your dreams away. Uh oh. Wait. Did on. What happened to the other ones? Where are the other guys? No! I'm confused. I came with three. I'm leaving with one. That's the first time I've ever seen that. What happened? I want to know now. Okay. I don't know what you're talking about. There is no suspect. I'm just a normal red blood-soaked taxi. Well, you know what? I should get a bigger cut because there's two less of you. Ooh. That's weird though. Like I said, I've never actually seen that. Where I don't have all the guys. It's only the one. It was literally only the one. Holy shit. Oh, and Joey's done. How about that? All right. Well, that's the end of the Joey arc. So, yeah. And definitely the end of the episode. Because this has been extremely long. So next time... That's going to be a race, so I'm going to have to prepare for that. Next time on Grand Theft Auto 3. Bye-bye!